Here's a great flow to try against the wall. The wall provides great sensory feedback. Go to warrior two, relax the shoulders, notice the toes of the front leg are turned out. Rotate the arms, extending that back arm up and over the ear. Keep the shoulders down away from the ears, the back leg straight, that outer foot is staying down. Go to triangle pose, straightening the front leg. Use a block for assistance. That's another great tool to help you with good form. To go to pyramid pose, take the back leg away from the wall. One hip will still be against the wall. You can lift the arms if that's okay for you and relax the back of the head. Go slower than I'm going here to get even more in tune with your body. Try and connect with it. From pyramid, extending long, it's a good transition to reverse triangle. Turn toward the wall. Notice the spine is lengthening. The navel is going in. And from the crown of the head to the tailbone, you're trying to create a straight line. The block really comes in handy here because you're keeping the front leg straight. Pick up the block. Go back to your warrior two, transition to half moon, dragging the back leg in, energy through that back leg, pressing the heel away from you, again using your block, the side that will provide you the best support and alignment. Come back to your warrior two, then turn the toes of the front foot forward. Step or leap your feet together.